This is your quick quiz on specific latent heat. These quick quizzes are a way for you to quickly test out your knowledge. State the unit of specific latent heat. State the equation for specific latent heat. Sketch a graph for temperature against time for a range of temperatures such that material will change between a solid, a liquid and a gas. Pause the video now and have a go at those questions and then we'll be back with the answers. The unit of specific latent heat is joules per kilogram because latent heat means the energy required to change the state of one kilogram of a substance. The equation is energy equals mass times specific latent heat. A graph of temperature against time would look something like this. This is a graph of temperature against energy but it's the same idea. In a solid, during the time in which it is a solid, the temperature will rise, then it will stay at the same temperature for fusion, which is either melting or freezing. In this case, it's melting because the temperature is increasing. We're heating the thing. And then as a liquid, its temperature will rise and then it will boil at vaporization. The temperature will stay the same during that change of state. And now we can increase the temperature of the gas by putting in more energy or heating it for a longer time. I hope that helped you understand what latent heat is all about. If you found that quite difficult, then you probably need to go over this topic again. So here's a playlist to help you do that. If you didn't, if you found them okay, then you wanna check that you can do that in an exam question. So here's an exam question playlist. Thanks a lot for watching Gorilla Physics. Make sure you do subscribe.